How many times can I PB before I can get a sub six? Four. I really hope not, because I have a six oh one right now. There's no feeling more intense than starting over. I'm getting teased. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as what I have, should be me? or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after what? spending an hour in the commute, if you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black. Kyle Hodge, you got your watching the Fast and Furious franchise immediately dropped food makes me want to rewatch them. So if now you want I'm going to download them. Friend, and then later discovered that they just returned I'm to working. their original view. Starting over is harder second. than starting Nothing. up. If you're not ready for that, Who did you just lie to? you've already had a bad day, yeah, no, no. then what you're about to go through might be too much. <clears throat> Feel free to go away and come back. I'm snitching. Alright. Thanks for coming on thing this trip. You I'll understand if you don't want to do is anyway. snitch on yourself that you're stop. snitching. Quit the game. Don't worry. No, I will. I'll save your what are you going to do always. about it? Even your mistakes. Snitch back, bozo. <laughs> to who? This game is a homage to a free game that came out in 2002 Ice. titled Sexy Hiking. Mm. Wait, 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 the author wait, wait. of that game was Jazor, <laughs> a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time design. as the father of B games. Too late. And B games are rough assemblages so of found I think your sister's worse than Designers ice. slap them together very quickly and freely, though, I mean, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gamers there. for following. No. They're built more for I the joy of really building them that. than as polished products. <laughs> In a certain way, Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B game. Right. It's built I almost entirely out of bound and recycled parts, and it's one of the most game. unusual and unfriendly games I'll be back in like. 30 minutes, in probably, it, about your task is simply to drag yourself up right. a mountain with a hammer. So yeah, yeah. The right, act boys. of climbing in the no digital bad. world or in real life has certain essential properties that give the game. I am flavor. totally legally downloading movies. No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. <laughs> Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. What? What's funny? And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. I am legally downloading. <laughs> I'm a bit Anyway, when you start sexy yeah, dude, hiking, the, you're standing the next to this to dead game. To be fair, I do have, have physical that. copies of all the movies, never got past it. but or I'm not about to go at it, exploring the limits of your to the Xbox your just strength. to watch movies. Trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of confidence. Well, we have, we have more copies, copies of all the movies. You can be completely confident in your ability we are supporting to them, them financially. We've also the seen the movies in theaters. Or the correct equipment, mm. or just by spending enough time. They got the money from us, sense, they don't care. Every pixelated okay, obstacle I'm gonna in Sexy and Hiking too. is real. Okay. What? Um, the obstacles in Sexy Hiking are unyielding. I, um, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing. And it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. Mm. Oh. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. Oh my hard. god. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle get out was my, my fault fucking as a floor. player rather okay. than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them, and it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit okay, so that turns those mountains into something real. I need... When you're building a video game world, you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with, and in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. For years now, people have been predicting that games would soon be made out of prefabricated objects, oh. bought in a store and assembled into a world. And for the most part, that hasn't happened, because the objects in the stores are trash. I don't mean they look bad or that they're badly made, although a lot of them are. I mean they're trash in the way that food becomes trash as soon as you put it in the sink. Things are made to be consumed and used in a certain context, and once the moment is gone, they transform into garbage. No. In the context of technology, those moments pass by in seconds. Okay, I've gone through fast Over time, five. we've poured more and more refuse fast. into this vast digital landfill that we call the internet. It now vastly outnumbers and outweighs the things bounce. that are fresh and untainted and unused. No. 
when everything around us is cultural trash, trash becomes the new medium, the lingua franca of the digital. Oh my God. <laughs>